When real trouble walks in the door, I need to make a phone call. the smart thing to do is finish your drink and run for your life. But Harry Barber doesn't drink. And as you can see, he isn't going anywhere. I have a job for you. There's an element of risk. You do take risks, don't you, Mr. Barber? My stepdaughter, Odette, is going to be kidnapped. The ransom will be $500,000. I need someone to be the threatening voice on the telephone. For making that call and for collecting the ransom, I'm willing to pay 10%. What's going on? Nothing is going on. You want to know if I'm in on this, right? Yes, I'm going to pretend to be kidnapped. Yes, Ray and I are going to ask my father for 500 grand. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, you know, this, this could work. The plan was perfect for everyone but Harry. Uh, Assistant DA Rennick would like you to come down to the courthouse. You said your husband wasn't going to involve the authorities. Nobody was supposed to get killed. We're talking about a murder case. I've got a message from Harry Barber. There's a body of a girl in the trunk of my car. Why don't we just pop her open anyway, Tegla? Might be surprised what we find. Are you involved in this, Mr. Barber? Yes! 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 They'll take saliva samples from the envelopes, the cigarette butt we found, and they'll profile his DNA with it. They can do that. Don't you watch TV? Palmetto. Something on your mind, Harry? 